What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from What's Up in the Sky 37 channel or you can catch me out online at www.whatsupinthesky.com Haven't been feeling well, just got back. It's been a while. Thank everybody for the well wishes. You all rock. I love my subscribers. If you're watching this later on and you see it, my, we just have really cool subscribers here. A nice group of people. Uh, which I've got you looking at. This is a picture from the rock nest I swore I'd come back to in my last video. I'll show you what we took a look at last time. This is what looks to be like a horse statue or at least a, the face of a horse if you see the you know if you can see the profile how it's laying there um, it would have its ears its eyes its, its mouth um, it looks to have some carved stuff there too I was watching a documentary let me show you well first let me show you how to get this right here um, here's where you get the picture you can download the TIFF file it's a little big but go ahead it is definitely worth it because you're gonna be doing some zooming in on this one it's a mosaic with an awful lot of pictures so let's see here let me go ahead and go to the preview again all right so what I did was I was watching a, a documentary on Hiroshima and the aftermath of it the other day and uh, some of the pictures in there were just uh, totally look like Mars so what I did was I went out and grabbed a couple and look at this stuff here that's been high heat has been applied to it see how it just melts everything uh, look at some of this over here look at this pottery I'm gonna take you right now to show you almost the exact same picture here on Mars look how the blocks they've all just you know stuff that was beautiful I did that again I just just lost my pad uh, my mouse pad here hopefully that'll come back in a second here we are good we're back all right and then see how everything even like this top had came off and it was just destroyed and I believe it's check this out look at this stuff you know how how perfect it is um, but check it so basically if you go here and get that picture come on out and then uh, come to this part here and let's go take a look at some of this we've got a whole bunch of stuff all right well, we looked at, well, first let me show you what we looked at last time, so if you remember this picture. We were looking at the, sorry to make you sick here, but I'll be slowing down here in a second. We looked at this area up here. It looks like to be like a dragon's head or a snake head there. With uh, This looks to be some sort of step pyramid as it goes up. Uh, that had beautiful, must have been beautiful at one time. Um, if you check back here, you can see how it seems to be built up. There's a lot on this picture when you take a look at them there's a lot of symmetry a lot of uh, interesting stuff well I told you to come back and look at the stuff at the bottom that looks like machinery and what a lot of people on YouTube are calling machinery um, like that horse right there I didn't find that that was found out there so let's get to breeze through there I thought it was just cool look like a little heart there I was like someone at NASA has given us love or some Mars love um, now let's take a good look at some of these I went through and so let's take another look right here at this, see how, see how some of this stuff looks with the high heat. My theories on Mars is that Mars was a very active planet, maybe had a, a war in it at one time. Something happened there, a lot of heat, there was an asteroid, something took it out and it's just taken debris and strode it across the landscape. Um, almost every area we look seems to have this stuff. Okay, now, now let's go down here and look at what seems to be a pan, like a pot, some sort of water, something that could hold something. See how it's got a... Uh, you know something like this pot right over there if you look at this it's got the two little things on top and even this one here has got the two little things on top so to me that looks like some sort of water thing and the area looks just like the other that it's been melted everything's been melted down um, there's so many perfect little things that seem to be shaped and carved um, this could have been a beautiful pretty pretty neat area um, let's go over here this is another good example of it some of these see up here kind of looks like a uh, looks like kind of like a desktop printer it's got the top of it let's say this was the paper coming out the top and this was where it spits out something see how it's going out but uh, to me that is just a very interesting rock if that's a rock it's got two holes in it right there um, just see how here it's got a lot of symmetry this seems to be cut with a lot you know precision right here does too see this right here as well this whole area looks like it's been just thrown about and possibly uh, and see how look see look how this is cut in okay this is off the rock but if you follow this it's it's part of a very intricate carving and ro see and see up here it's got the circle like uh, parts to it up here it looks to be cut very and look at this off of here it actually has some sort of wire maybe or some sort of rock cut off um, this is a pretty pretty 
decent cut. Up here is a pretty decent cut. This looks just like uh, something that had been cut right here. Uh, look at the the X in there, how it comes up. Look at this. It's just really formed. Another block right there that's been formed. That's been uh, look. It's got a little hole right there. Uh, a lot of this stuff it just looks like it was it was part of something until it came and boosh something hit Mars or something uh, you know war or something happened there here's some of this uh, what I see as something with a hole in it see that now if that was a rock see how you can see back behind it through it um, it matches the color here um, some, that's got to be something like metal or something sheet rock have you ever seen a hole in a rock that thick I haven't and see how everything here look how this is hollowed out right here and I think if you look at one of these pictures I downloaded you can see some of that hollowing um, just in this you know junk pile here uh, where was it it was maybe it wasn't in one of these pictures but as you can see back here all this other stuff that was there and uh, these are pictures taken I guess this was a, uh, a display but see how this right here seems to have the hollow part uh, there was a couple good pictures on Google that had copyrights on them. I couldn't use them on here um, so now here's a good example of either some manipulation by NASA or possibly see how this area right here is blurrier than this coming right here now this was put presented as a mosaic so that means that there's all sorts of pictures that go into making this now either this block was more uh, what is the word uh, you know, more low resolution than the rest of them or there's some interesting stuff they needed to block out and to me this looks like a tank you know a ballast tank or something like that along with a perfect circle here that's in front of that's behind this right here that goes out something right there also this looks to be metal um, almost like it's been chopped off of an engine it looks like a huge like a head to something like an engine head that's uh, just a huge it has all sorts of compartments there's a lot of this now this could, just could be lava or from heat or something that formed these but the, just the look of it that bright metallic look to it is very interesting to me uh, along with this right here see how this circle has what looks like a time clock kinda around the corner of it but that could just be rivets that go around it um, let's see what I was pointing at here just in the, oh you know here's another I just did that every time I drop my pad there my trackpad it goes offline hopefully I'll come back connection loss connection hand alright come on back alright well either way alright here we go oh now we're gonna get that uh oh alright good okay so see this right here see how it kinda looks like a big fat circle it's got a couple arms, a couple legs, and this this weird face to it. I found a couple of these little things on here. I'm wondering if this is some sort of biological life, or maybe was a. Uh, let's see where I found that other one at. It was just very interesting. I'm gonna find them next, but check this out. Another, a lot of this stuff over here just looks like that burn up stuffed in those pictures. Um, so let me see if I can find that little porky piggy thing I don't know what to call him little porky piggy that's exactly what he looked like let's see okay there's the one again I know he's here some up oh, there he is again so there's two in that same area see this right here he's just kind of have his head here like an anteater arms coming off of him a protective shield on his back you know, maybe that just looks kind of like armadillo or something. And then up here is another one. So, what do you guys think? Uh, you know, this is a very interesting one here. A lot of stuff on it. Let me see if I did that to my trackpad again. I gotta stop dropping it when I'm making the videos. <laughs> this is getting bad. <coughs> Sorry about that. Still have a little bit of that cold. Hope that didn't blow up the uh, the audio. But okay let's see if that came back that didn't come back so anyway let me know what you guys think these are let's comment below check out some of this like I said I come I promised I'd come back and show you some of the bottom stuff of this picture and there's still another video too of the bottom right hand corner we didn't get that has so much crazy symmetry and stuff that if you go ahead and look online you're gonna find it um, download that picture once again I think it looks a lot like this stuff here that's just been melted and totally uh, 
totally spewed, you know, strewn across the area. It looks like a bomb went off. Something happened in this area. And let's see that little guy again. The little porky piggy. Let me make him big on the screen. So if you want to step back and look at him as high resolution as you can, there he is. Let me see if I pump up the uh, sharpness a little bit if that helps. So, and then let me show you real fast as I've got my mouse pad back the other couple areas that are really neat to look at that we're going to come back to another day. Where did they go? Oh, here they are. Just these areas in general look to be definitely something like a machine that has been totally hit by something. See how it's melted on each other. It looks like whatever force did this with all the right angles and all the circles and all the connections in this. And see this box out here and this here. It's just too too intricate, too made. What looks to be you know, very intricate machining has been done here and uh, looks to have been destroyed. So, you know, what's the what's the whole revelation behind this? Who knows? Maybe we need to wake up and not destroy our planet. Um, or maybe we can go back over and help take this planet and do something with it. I know we want to go there. That's, that's everybody's plans. Um, look at that little circle there but anyway I could sit here and look at this one for hours as I know anybody watching this probably could go ahead and uh, comment below let me know what you think uh, appreciate the person who brought this back up his name was Kevin I uh, had forgotten totally about coming back and hitting this area up and this guy there's a couple people here swear that there are sunbathers up in this area up here that are they look like people sunbathing I haven't seen them if you guys can point them out whoever sent them take a screenshot and point that out to me much love guys take it easy how long did I go here 11 minutes 12 minutes sorry guys long one peace